the rich in the society. Welcome, good day, and hello to Silent Time, the opportunity to think on what is really important in life. Does it not sound familiar? The rich in the society, already Amos, God told via the prophet Amos 6, verse 6, you drink wine by the bowlful and use the finest perfumes, but you do not mourn over the ruin of the country. Is it not similar still in many places today? Some areas and countries, some people living in extreme riches, while others suffer in poverty. And even in the so-called democracies, people demand short-term policies. The government spends a lot for them that they can live in luxury, not caring about what happens in the long term. Drink the wine by the bowlful and use the finest perfumes but do not care for the ruin of the country. What are we to do? What are, What is the society called to do? What are especially those who are rich called to do? Of course, we are called to give thanks to the Lord, to give praise to him. All people, no matter of which background, living in poverty, living in luxury, to pray to the Lord, to ask for wisdom and to do good to others, to build up the life of others, because then the kingdom of God has already started, maybe only on a small scale, maybe only like a mustard seed. And still it means that we open the life to God, that he can enter, that he can work through his Holy Spirit. Also Paul commands in the letter to Timothy, as for those who in the present age are rich, command them not to be haughty or to set their hopes on the uncertainty of riches, but rather on God, who richly provides us with everything for our enjoyment. They are to do good, to be rich in good works, generous and ready to share, thus storing up for themselves the treasure of a good foundation for the future, so that they may take hold of the life that really is life. First Timothy 6, verses 17 to 19. Lord, we thank you for all that you provide, also for all the good things that you provide. You see how much evil things are going on, that some people... Do not care for others. Do not care about the future. Just take in selfishness and involve in bribery, in wrongdoing, in finding only their own benefit. Thank you that you want to provide justice and that even amongst all the evil going on in the world, you still provide for everyone. Thank you for your protection. We ask for forgiveness for all wrongdoing. We ask that you may talk to us and may show to everybody what to do, what we can influence, how we can help others, how we can start your kingdom in this world. We pray that you be with us and with all, be especially with those who suffer, who suffer from poverty, who suffer, suffer from persecution from all kinds of evils and be also with those who are rich and influential and give wisdom give them a good mind fill them with your holy spirit thanks for all that you provide that we can call you your father and that you provide all the things also the good things to enjoy praise and glory and honor be to you forever amen